The day is passing slowly for head keeper Alan Woodward and his staff. They're waiting for the zoo's two new cheetahs to arrive from Dubai. Their plane touched down at Manchester some time ago, but apparently they've been held up at customs. It's now ten past five. We're still waiting for the cheetahs to arrive. Um, it should be any time now, hopefully, because um, they left Manchester about four o'clock. It takes about an hour or so to, to come to Manchester Airport, so literally any time now, hopefully. At last, the special quarantine van arrives from the airport with its precious cargo. It's the cue for a huge sigh of relief from zoo registrar Penny Rudd. This is the final hurdle. It's really nice to be at this stage. Um, we've got everybody on standby. There's been so much paperwork involved. And actually, it's not just that. It's the communications, because you're talking to people all the time. And um, we didn't have confirmation of this flight until 5.30 last night, which is coming very, very fine to alert DEFRA and everybody to what we're doing. So, uh, yeah, it's um, always a bit against the wire, these imports and exports. And so after days, weeks, and months of preparation, there's just a tantalizing glimpse of the newcomers before they go behind closed doors and into quarantine. Kevin, just to let you know that teachers are on site and they're within the perimeter fence now, so we're just about to unload them into quarantine. They're looking fine, actually, absolutely fine. They're, they're only youngsters, um, about 11 months old, so um, they, they look pretty unstressed, they're not bothered. They don't, they're, they're, they're probably slightly easier to um, move around than some of the other cats. Very good, yeah, very not, alert. Not stressed? Not too stressed, no, they're, they're calming down a bit now, just about oh, coming yeah. together. Yeah, they're quite calm, but it is a good rest now. 